English conversations in daily life. These lessons cover a few topics that you'll face very often in your daily life. Please watch the video to improve your English listening and speaking skills. How about a pizza? I'm feeling hungry. Let's grab a bite. What should we eat? Up to you. Hmm. Do you want to eat beef steak? Again? Let's eat something else. I want to do something different for a change. How about pizza? There's a new restaurant near our school. Which one? It's a pizza company. The pizza and appetizers there are top notch. Oh, I have heard about it. People said it had a tasty menu. We'll order Chicago pizza. It's the restaurant's best selling product. Okay, let's go to that pizzeria. My laptop is so slow. Did you buy a laptop? That's right. I just bought it last week. What's wrong with your old laptop? My old laptop is too slow. It's always laggy and I can't work. What's the deal with it being so slow? I don't know. Maybe it's too old. What specifications are available on this laptop? It has 8 gigabytes of RAM, 2 gigabyte graphics, and an i5 processor. How much did you buy it for? Not too expensive. 500 US dollars. Well, that's a good price. Right? I bought it on the day the store was having a sale. Do you have a girlfriend? Do you have a girlfriend? No, I'm still single. And you? Are you married? No, not yet. So, do you have a girlfriend? Yeah, I'm in a relationship. A pretty cool. Who is that? She was my college friend. How long have you guys been dating? We've only been dating for four months. So great. Is that the girl you had a crush on in college? That's right. Luckily, she also has feelings for me. Congratulations, you. Walking the dog. What are you going to do? I have to take the dog for a walk. What kind of dog do you own? I have a little poodle. Poodles bark a lot. Right? He is very noisy. I heard them bark all the time. Yeah, they never stop. What made you decide to adopt a poodle? That's my mother's dog. She adores poodles. Borrowing money. Hey, Philip, could I borrow some money? Sure. How much do you need? Ten dollars. Okay. Why are you borrowing money from me? I need to buy dinner. All right, but where's your money? I was in a hurry this morning, so I didn't bring my wallet. So you left your wallet at home? Yes, right. It's uncomfortable when you don't have money with you. Right? 
even if only for a short time. Yeah, so having friends is always beneficial. When you're broke, your friends will lend you money, as long as you repay them. Going to the beach. <laughs> It's a beautiful day today. Let's go to the beach. That sounds great. Okay, I'll get the beach umbrella and beach chairs, and put them in the car. Great. I'll pack some snacks and drinks. Should I bring my surfboard? Sure, and don't forget sunscreen and sunglasses. I won't. I don't want to get sunburned again. I'll bring the camera. I want to take pictures of the sunset. Good idea. The sunset is beautiful at the beach. Do you remember the last time we went to the beach? No, it's been a long time. Why don't we go more often? Because we're always busy. My wife left me. Are you married? I、uh, used to be, but now I'm single. How long have you been divorced? Two years ago. What was the reason for your divorce? My wife left me. Why did she do that? She claimed she no longer loved me. Oh my goodness, that's awful. But it is the truth. Now she's living with another man. Why did she stop loving you? As I said above, she is living with another man. That's my best friend. She loves my best friend. What's on TV? Jenny, help me turn on the TV. You want to watch The Witcher, right? Yes, it's my favorite film. I've waited a long time. Then I've got some bad news for you. It's been canceled. How is that possible? Won't they air the new season today? They filmed two episodes, but while filming, the main actor was seriously injured. Oh no! I've been waiting nearly two years for its return. But don't worry, they will air it soon. So boring. You can turn on the TV and watch other programs. Oh well, nothing that's interesting. Oh, I heard the president is giving a televised speech tonight. A nice place to live. I enjoy living here. I concur. Tokyo is a nice place to live. It's the capital of Japan. It has lovely homes. It has excellent restaurants. The Japanese capital has more Michelin stars than any other place on Earth. It's no surprise Tokyo is one of the world's best food destinations. <music> It has excellent educational facilities. Tokyo is a city with skyscrapers and modern facilities. The people there are pleasant and friendly. I'll never move to another place. Me too. I love this city. The new mattress. It's time for bed. I'm not ready to go to sleep. I'm not tired. 
It's quite late, and you have an early day tomorrow. Okay, Mom, but I think we need a new mattress. What's the problem with this one? This mattress is too old. It's not as comfortable as it used to be. I think it still looks good. No, I've been tossing and turning all night. Hmm, you can't sleep because you drink coffee. You should give up coffee. Look at the red marks on my arms. What exactly are they? I was bitten by bedbugs in that mattress. Okay, I see. Now go to bed, and tomorrow I'll buy you a new mattress. I live in Pasadena. Where were you born? I was born in Pasadena. Pasadena? Yeah, Pasadena is a city in Los Angeles County, California. Is it in southern Los Angeles? No, it's northeast of downtown Los Angeles. Is Pasadena a big city? Yeah, it is the most populous city and the primary cultural center of the San Gabriel Valley. What is the population? Its population is 141,275. <gasps> How big is Los Angeles? Los Angeles is the largest city in California. It has an estimated population of nearly 4 million. I have a Honda. Do you own a vehicle? Yeah, I have one. What sort of vehicle do you drive? I own a Honda. When did you buy this car? I bought it in 2003. So, it's rather old now. Right, however, the engine of the car is still very good. Do you usually take it to the salon car? Yes, I always take it in for routine maintenance. How often do you replace the oil? A technician replaces the oil in my car twice a year. The New House Well, this is our new house. Very nice. I like the garden. Yes, we like it too. Anyway, come in. Thank you. Well, this is the hall and this is the living room. Very nice. That's a nice big window. Now, upstairs, we've got three bedrooms. I see. Oh, this is beautiful. Oh, and you've got a balcony. Yes, we really like it. The view is really good. Yes, I can see. And is that the garage down there? Yeah, let's go downstairs. Would you like a cup of tea with some cookies? I'd love to, thanks. Fish are everywhere. The ocean is enormous. You can't seem to see the end of it. Right? It covers most of the Earth's surface. I believe it is five miles deep. Many mysterious creatures live on the bottom of the ocean. And there's plenty of fish in the sea. But how many? I'm not sure anymore. But according to scientists, 
the total mass of fish in the ocean is about ten times greater than thought. Are there more fish or more people? I believe there are more fish. I'm hoping so. I enjoy eating fish. Talking animals. Do animals communicate with one another? Of course they communicate with one another. What do they discuss? They discuss other animals. What else do they discuss? They discuss food and the weather. Do they mention us? Of course they mention us. What do they think of us? Hmm. They think we have a strange appearance. Oh, well, animals are more amusing to look at than humans. We have a strange appearance since we wear clothes. I have a sister. How many people are there in your family? There are four people in my family. How about you? Have you got any brothers or sisters? I've got a sister. What's her name? Her name is Miona. How old is she? She's four years older than me. What does your sister do? She works as a teacher in a local primary school. Are you close to your sister? Yes, she's my great sister, and to me, she's my best friend. Whenever I have problems and confidence, I freely share with her without hesitation. House cleaning day. Nice weather we're having. Would you like to go to the movies with me? I'm sorry, I'm afraid I can't. I have to clean the house today. Clean it up tomorrow. It's okay. No, you see, my house is very untidy, so I clean it up at once. What do you have to do? I have to do several loads of laundry, vacuum the whole house, and clean the kitchen. Wow, that's a lot of stuff to do. Right? My mother will visit tomorrow. I completely understand. She likes a very neat and tidy house. I know what you mean. Why doesn't your husband help you? He did help me. He mowed the lawn, cleaned all of the bathrooms, and set up the guest room yesterday. A TV lover. You're watching too much television. What exactly do you mean? I'm referring to the fact that you're wasting time. I'm having a good time. You just lie in the chair all day. So what? Since you're my best friend, I care about you. Stand up, go outside, and exercise. Thanks, but let me see the end of this episode. You said the same thing yesterday. I promise you, I'll go out to exercise after watching this episode. It's up to you. Okay, you're always grumbling. Now I've turned off the TV. Write to your grandma. Did you write your letter to your grandma? I did, indeed. Have you told her anything about school? I told her that school is enjoyable. 
Did you enclose your letter in an envelope? I did, and I also sealed the envelope. Did you put a stamp on the envelope? I was unable to locate any stamps. They may be found in the kitchen drawer. Oh, it's here. Just hand me the envelope and I'll send it to you. Thanks, Mom. But when will Grandma learn about email? Are you sleepy? What's the cause of our yawning? I'm tired. Why don't you get some sleep? I wanted to see this television show. You can watch it again on YouTube. But my computer is broken. I think you should go to sleep now. You're very sleepy. I'll watch for another ten minutes. Okay, now that the commercial is showing, you should go to sleep. Then I'll go to sleep. All right, I'll tell you how the show ends. Thanks. God is watching. Today is Sunday. So, how about that? You understand what I mean. Oh, sorry, I forgot. On Sundays, we go to church. Oh, I see. Don't forget to put on a coat and tie. Why is that? To be respectful to God and the people. I'm glad Sunday just happens once a week. I pray God didn't hear you say that. I'm sure he'll forgive me. Feed the cat. Have you fed the cat? <gasps> oh, I forgot. I'm too busy doing my homework. There's a meowing sound coming from the cat. He's starving. I'm going to feed him right now. You should not keep him waiting. You know, I was finishing up my schoolwork. The cat seems unconcerned about your schoolwork. The cat is unconcerned about anything. That's just how cats are. They're just concerned about themselves. Perhaps we should let him go. No way! He's a member of the family. All right, I'll feed him right away. Shave your face. I hate shaving. Yeah, me too. Every time I shave, I always bleed. Were you using a fresh blade? It makes no difference. Whether using old or new blades, I always bleed. Perhaps you should try using an electric shaver. I've used it before, but it doesn't give a close shave. Maybe you shouldn't shave. Do you want to grow a beard? Sure thing. What's the harm? Because food and other debris got caught in my beard. Hmm. I think you should buy shaving cream. Two polite people. Excuse me. Yes, can I help you? Is this newspaper yours? Oh no, it's not mine. Help yourself. Oh yes, because I see the newspaper next to you, so I asked you. You're so polite. Yeah, it would be rude to take things without asking someone else's permission. I agree. Some individuals are so impolite. I always make an effort to be courteous. 
I agree. More nice individuals like us are needed in the world. Lol, I completely agree. Give me a puppy. Mom, I'd like to get a puppy. I'll think about it. Why do you have to consider it? Because a puppy is expensive. No, it's not. Puppies are completely free. Yes, but a puppy requires vaccination. Vaccination for what? So it doesn't become ill. But vaccination is not very expensive. And a puppy needs food. Dog food is expensive, honey. Don't worry, I'll offer him something from my plate. No, you don't. Puppies don't consume veggies. Kittens to give away. Take a look at all of these kitties. How many cats do you have? A total of eight. They're all so adorable. But I can't take care of them all. So what will you do? I think I'll need to give them to someone who needs them. Do you want an adorable kitten? Yes, I'd want one. Which one do you prefer? Yes, that one. That one's completely black. Yes, I like that one as well. I will name him Black. Happy in heaven. My parents always go to church on Sunday. Uh, do your parents believe in God? Yes, they hope to go to heaven. They most likely will. However, no one knows for certain. Without a doubt. Nobody knows what happens to us when we die. If we're good, we should be happy with God in paradise. That's what a lot of people think. If we're evil, we'll go to hell forever. I don't want to go to hell. You're a good person. On Sunday, go to church with your parents. His line is never busy. <laughs> My husband passed away. I'm sorry for your loss. Thank you so much. When did he pass away? Several months ago. You're still missing him? Yes, but I speak with him nearly every day. <gasps> you talk to him when you go to church? No, I call him every day. What exactly do you mean? I buried him with his cell phone. What will you do if the battery runs out? Friday the 13th. It's Friday the 13th. Friday the 13th is considered an unlucky day. Yeah, it happens at least once every year, but can occur up to three times in the same year. So, I will be at home today. That's exactly what I do. On Friday the 13th, my friend stayed at a motel. That was a blunder. Yeah, he stayed on the 13th floor. Can you tell me what happened? His laptop was stolen. <gasps> It's really bad luck. He's learned his lesson. This year, he'll just stay at home. Do you love me? Do you truly love me? Obviously. You say you love me, so prove it. How am I going to prove it? Take me out to supper. Is that all? Anything else? 
Please take me to a decent restaurant rather than McDonald's. But a decent restaurant isn't cheap. But I want to eat steak. Ugh, it's troublesome. I had a feeling you didn't love me. All right, all right. I'm going to make a reservation now. We're going to have a steak. Dad has a girlfriend. My parents are divorced. <gasps> What caused your parents to divorce? My father has a new girlfriend. Really? Did your father <gasps> cheat on your mother? <gasps> yes, mom was upset and enraged. What did your mother do when she found out your father cheated? She told him to break up with his girlfriend. What exactly did your father do? <laughs> He's left our home. <laughs> That's bad. My dad dumped my mom and me. I believe he liked his new girlfriend a lot. Yes, but she dumped him after a year. They deliver. The cost of stamps continues to rise. I believe stamps used to be a cent. That happened a long time ago. It happened before I was born. A stamp now costs 42 cents. However, It will be 44 cents in May. Have you ever had a letter go missing in the mail? No, I haven't. Neither have I. So, for the money, they do an excellent job. They do indeed. Perhaps we shouldn't complain. A lost button. My shirt's button fell off. Why did the button fall off? I don't know, so I need to locate the button. Where did you drop your button? I'm not sure. Hmm, it is difficult to find a button. Did you check your pocket? That's a nice idea. I once discovered a button in my pocket. Let me see. Oh no, it's not in there. Don't worry. Many shirts include an additional button. Yeah, there is an additional button on here. All you have to do now is sew it on. Did you say something? I'm hungry. I will open the fridge, see if there's anything to eat. It's already 12 o'clock at night. Is there anything wrong? Right? Eating at night is very harmful. What are the effects of eating late? When you eat a late night dinner, it leads to several gastric issues. <gasps> really? Yeah, and eating late leads to weight gain. Have you checked yourself in the mirror? Do you think I'm going to grow fat? I didn't say anything like that. What exactly did you say? I just said that eating at night is bad for your health. Washed and folded. Have you done your laundry? I did, indeed. What have you washed? I washed the bedding and towels. What about the pillowcases? I did take them off the pillows and wash them. Did you use the dryer to dry everything? Yes, I did use the dryer to dry everything. So, what did you do after that? I folded every towel. Did you put the bed sheets on? 
Yes, and I also put the pillowcases on the pillows. Talk radio. Do you like to listen to the radio? I listen all hours of the day and night. What music do you listen to? I mostly listen to talk radio. What is it? People discuss current affairs. What do they have to say? For example, they argued with each other whether to reduce gas prices or not. I agree with the gas price reduction. Me too. Gasoline prices are very high right now. I spend a lot of money on commuting. The government should make a decision on reducing petrol prices. A bad diet. I'm starving, Mom. Check the refrigerator. Oh no, there isn't anything to eat. Are you certain? It's nearly empty. Yesterday I went to the market. I'm not seeing anything. I went out and purchased a bunch of oranges and apples. I'm not interested in fruit. I'm craving something delicious. Eat fruit. It's beneficial to your health. Let me accompany you to the market next time you go. No, you always want to buy hot dogs and candy bars. It's not good for health at all. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share, comment on my video. Please subscribe to Learn English with Jessica channel to watch more helpful videos. Goodbye.